Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Tragic Life. Last time we beat the uh, Lu Lunarians Dungeon 1. <clears throat> I went and got everything out of it. I don't know if this is the last thing you get every time, or if this is just one of the items you get. But once you get this one, you can go do the second one. So, um, without further ado, let's go ahead and go find the second dungeon. Where are we? We need everything. So, let's check our items. Uh... Go buy some stuff before we roll, because we won't be nicely here. I'll go ahead and buy all of those. All right, quick sells the tents. Get out of my way. All right, cool. You're the hummingways. Get out of my way. Okay, so no. All right. So before we do anything, we're going to go ahead and use the cottage. So the good news is this is our last dungeon before we start making our way to the end of the game. So you're going to come down here. And then go right. There it is. All right. So we've been here before. This was our dungeon challenge in the original game. Alright, let's do this. Ah, you have the proof of courage. My goodness, you are ready to challenge the world with that in hand. The lunar face has doubtlessly recognized your power. A new challenge is about to unfold before you. Best of luck along the way. Alright, so this one's supposed to be a little harder. Um, there are five, four items. A defender, Aegis shield, a rare band, and Agmatite. Those are your rewards. All right. All right. Excuse me. Two <clears throat> corals and a mithril golem, I think it was. Okay, so hold on. All right, we got an ether. Is there anything else I need to be worried about here? All right, that was one coral and two hell flappers. All right, so we're gonna go back. Um, I feel like I did something wrong. Hold on. All right, that was a lamia and two hell flappers. Hold on. I think I missed something. All right, that was a Lamia and the. Uh... Dang it, I didn't buy anything for my eyeballs. That's that. Um, fraud. That was also to. Uh... Two hell flappers and a Lamia. Alright. I'm a little confused. So it says, go right into the hidden passage to an even, then go back north and right into the wall to find a second passage to a door. Okay, so let's let's do this systematically. Okay, so that was the either, right? That was two balloons and a balfour. All right, give me a second, be right back. Okay, I figured it out. So I was supposed to leave before I got the X potion. I was supposed to go right into this one. All right, that was a Lamia and a <clears throat> two health lappers, and they got me that time. It, it's gonna happen. All right, there's my high potions. 
Alright. So from here. Ah, here we go. And then this will lead us to two chests. A coral excursion. Alright, that was a chimera brain. Oh, I didn't even get the second treasure. I didn't feel like fighting that. That was uh two corals and a, a uh, mithril golem. All right, so now we're back on track. Sorry, guys. We're gonna run from that. That's a lot of mythical mist mist emails. All right, that was two balloons and a Belphegor. Oh, it's right here. Okay, this dungeon sucks. I haven't even got into the meat of it yet, and. The corals are problematic. It also doesn't help that I came in here on the waxing moon, which weakens my black magic, so there is that. All right, so let's continue forward. It's got a high encounter rate. I mean, again, that's been a problem with this entire game. Um, I don't mind random encounters with this game. Phew. All right. Let's go back to where you were. Head north, all right. So, which way? Head north, it looks like we're gonna, probably gonna go into this. All right, that was another Lamia and two Hell Flappers. All right, so, um, Chesta here has a minor, a random minor item and reveals every run. So it will always be here, it's always minor though. Okay. Yeah, I didn't feel like that one either. Uh, my magic is not strong enough for a lot of these fights right now. I've done messed up. Problem is, I'm also running out of magic. Um, I do have plenty of either, though, for once. Alright, so. Uh. Yeah, no. I got another X potion. Alright, that was a Chimera Brain. Okay. Should be a lunar curtain. All right. It's not the longest dungeon. All right, so we're gonna go right first. Here it is. Hold on. Okay, go right for another X potion. All right, I'm gonna take the wide center path. All right, that was two Belphagors. All right. <clears throat> All right. All right, it's not dry either. And an X potion. We're getting a lot of X potions. All right, that was two Black Knights and a Mithril Golem. That one wasn't too bad. All right, so I think we're gonna go. Where are we going next? Da -da 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 -da. Ramp to the right of the door has a doorway. All right, welcome back. So, when I went into this door, I got wiped out by two Belphegors. They they landed two success with tornadoes in a row and then hit me. So, it, <clears throat> pain in the butt. So, I had to go all the way through the dungeon. So, I actually uh, used two cottages. So <laughs> I wasn't coming here with uh, bad black magic, and this dungeon changes. So, I missed the light curtain right here. Um, yeah, I'm not going to fight two Belphegors no more. They have a high chance of wiping you. All right, so we have a safe fight. Yes, yes, yes. Alright. Alright, what does that do? That doesn't lower my black magic, but I kind of want my... I do realize that when I came through, I missed the first lunar curtain. So it is what it is. I've gotten everything else, and uh, with the black magic, 
being stronger because of the moon, this dungeon's not as difficult as well. It's still difficult, but it's still, it's not as, you know what I mean? All right. <clears throat> And I get it, it's supposed to be challenging, so. Alright, so it wants me, let's see, down here. Uh, walk around the circular path so we can go downstairs, got it. Uh, there's some randomness to the path, I don't like that, I don't want to hear that. Head to the left. Wait. Yeah, I'm not fighting anything. Oh, I hate this. All right, that was a blood eye and a chimera. Oh, I hate this dungeon. By a lot. Alright, that was two fell knights. <clears throat> okay, let's so let's All right, that was two fell knights. Um, I'm thinking about pausing this to see how I can find a path, um, because this is getting annoying. Be right back. Okay, so I think I found it. I didn't open the chest, so I'm not 100% sure, but if you keep going past that door there, you can come all the way down. Ah, no. It's a remedy. This isn't what I was after. There's an either in here I missed. Uh, is that the only thing I missed in here? Let me see. Uh, Oh, this is, this is, oh, man, um, okay. So there's randomness, so there's no way to know if I got what I was supposed to get or not. So we're going to go continue forward like we did, okay? Uh, there are three passes on the floor, some are dead ends. It's a random, <sighs> so there's no way to know which one you got until you get there. All right, so that one's dead. Got it, got it. Looks like this, the third one was too. Um, that's what I figured. Okay, so we're good. What do we got? Either. There's my either. <laughs> okay, um, I can go further. Uh, what's over here? Are you serious? I just. <laughs> oh my. Oh heck no. Oh, heck no. That was a Count Marble. That that wasn't going to happen. Okay. Um, I don't feel like fighting them either. Uh, we got a dry either. Um, yeah, yay. What a dungeon. Okay, so this way. Uh, is this the exit? All right, we made it. Yay. Okay. Um, okay, so we want to rest to the waning moon. Because I think this is the boss. Um... And before we do that, let's go ahead and put Gobez. He doesn't have one. Supposed to give him the power on it. Okay, um, so yeah, that, that's gonna be fun. All right, so I'll be right back. All right, so we're back. Um, so we need to rest till the whack, waning moon. Okay, cool. We'll go ahead and talk to him and then I'll pause it. You know how we do it. Okay, so we'll go ahead and pause it. So, Armstrong is a physical brute. He has Fire Agra, but mostly uses normal attacks. His thing is that when he is hit by magic, his attack power increases. And then he counters with Laser Barrage to kill a party member. So, do not use magic on him. That includes slow. So, what we're going to do is we're going to haste Fasoya and Gobez, and then Berserk Gobez, and have Fasoya cast and cast Blink to absorb the attacks. 
Um, we'll just do this over and over. When Pusoy runs out of MP, cast Osmos on Gobez. Once you get Gobez hasted Berserk, he should do around 1500 damage or more to Armstrong every turn. He'll attack automatically so we can focus our attention on Fusoya. Uh, the Waning Moon powers up Armstrong's attacks too, but with a blink and the Armstrong's very low speed, he shouldn't be able to connect with physical attacks very often. So, um, when he gets weak, sometimes he self-destructs, which does a lot of damage. So keep your HP up. All right. Um, so we're going to go ahead and cast Haste on me first. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and throw a High Potion here. We're going to wait a second before we attack. We're going to get set up first. He doesn't attack a lot, so there's that. Um, haste. See how much damage we do right now. 14, that's not terrible. Alright, so we're gonna attack again. Um, I want to. Blink. We need to keep our characters alive. I should have blinked me first, but oh well. I didn't mean to do that. Why did I do that? No, uh, Remedy. Okay, so... That's what I was a little bit worried about. Okay, um, item Phoenix down. I mean, there's a high chance this guy's gonna beat me. It, it's definitely a possibility. Um, oh, dang it. I mean, we have them, right? Why not? The fire arc is not that problem. I mean, he hits, you, he hits hard if he hits you by himself, but... Alright, so we're gonna go ahead... We're gonna blink at me right now. Okay, that's good, that's good. Attack again. Uh, we're going to... Haste me, come on. Alright, now we're at 23, that's awesome. So we're gonna go ahead... Zerk here. Why is the blank not working still? I don't care about that. I need blink. Especially on Gobez. Because he's my attacker. This is not a fun fight. Did he hit both of us? No. Oh, he's gonna kill somebody. He's probably gonna... If he doesn't hit both of us, he's gonna kill Gobez. 
or damn near. Okay, I'm gonna cast, um... Okay, we got him. So that's how you beat him. Kind of a pain, but but not overtly difficult. Um, so there is that. That's kind of cool. Um, let's go ahead and see. I don't really feel like this is going to take me too long to get through because the, the dungeon itself is short if I'm not going for all the treasures. And there's only four. So um, are you kidding me? It gave me a mega elixir. How disrespectful. All right, so um, I'm going to go and get everything off this, and then uh, after that, we're going to start the storyline again, guys. Uh, yeah, yay. So, yeah. See you next time. Adios, guys.